want you to do me a quick favor. If you're playing a Mario game, and good on you for multitasking, by the way, whether it's party, car, whatever, take a second to think, when did that come out? You got your guess? Officially the first game released in Japan in July of 1983. Been a while, right? That same year also happens to be the last time a U.S. skier won a World Cup distance race. Of course, that was a course until this weekend. Our Athlete of the Week made that drought end. The tears were certainly flowing for Gus Schumacher this weekend. The Anchorage native and former service cougar accomplished something not done in more than four decades, becoming the first U.S. skier to win a World Cup distance race since Bill Koch in 1983. Once the final times were in, he told NBC Sports, quote, I'm just so grateful for this whole team and just everybody being here. It just feels like it represents such a big thing for our team, and I just really love doing it with these guys, and I hope this is the first of many. This has been a great season. Thanks, everybody, for coming. This has been the best day ever. That result for many of his coaches was no surprise. This is years of training, dedication, you know, commitment. And yeah, and Jim, I think I'm through, and I, I know that he will do it someday. <laughs> and after this win, many feel support for U.S. skiing has never been higher, with Schumacher blazing a trail others hope to follow. Most important, they believe that they can do it. You know, like we're talking 20 years ago, nobody could even dream that we can win a World Cup. Right? And right now it's happening, and, and you know, they are closer, closer, and win means that we can do it. Yeah, Gus, what, probably my biggest inspiration, like first seeing him win when maybe when I was in middle school, his World Junior Championship, he won the gold and the, won the first, first ever United States male World Junior Champion. It's insane. Every day he's doing something crazy, and I try and I want to be as good as him, better even. An iconic performance indeed, and at this rate, it could just be the first of many in Schumacher's young career.